Hello everybody, I'm Sarah and I'm a recorder player. What do grades 1 to 8 sound like on the recorder? I've teamed up with ABRSM to try out their new syllabus and try and play it all for you. Let's go! New syllabus, new composers, much wider range of styles of music. I'm so happy about this. For grade 1 we've got the traditional Japanese um, sakura sakura. For grade two, we've got the Menuetto by Joseph Ballon, Chevalier de Saint-Georges, arranged by Althea Talbot Howard. Was my Rallentando too big there? Examiners can tell me. Let's do some descant soprano, shall we? Tilman Susato, the bus dance Bergeret. For grade four, we have Waltz for Anna by Catherine Bennett. This is grade four, but I really had to practice this one. Are you ready? For grade five, we've got Fanny Dillon, a solo tune uh, by O'Carolan. On the new syllabus, there are more opportunities to play unaccompanied or accompanied pieces as you wish. On the new syllabus, rather than grouping pieces into accompanied and unaccompanied, they've been divided into the characteristics of the music. 
which is much more how I would actually put together a concert programme. List A are pieces that require technical dexterity, uh, finger work. List B are more lyrical expressive pieces and list C are pieces that show a wide range of musical styles. Let's play this. For grade six, I've chosen Artemis Dancers by Sally Adams. I mainly chose it for the high D sharp at the end. <laughs> this is unaccompanied, but something else really nice on the syllabus is that you can also play duets. On grades one to three, there are duet options where you can play with two recorders rather than recorder and piano. It does add its own challenges. For example, tuning with two recorders, that's a skill to learn. It's basically to encourage you to play with other people in any way you can. Um, and this opens it up if you've not got a pianist available. I don't have a pianist available in my little room, but for grade seven, I've got something for you. The Sonata in C Major by Handel. Oh, this is a classic. It's been on the grade seven list for a million years and it's not going anywhere. I know I'm talking about the new syllabus today, but I decided to choose one of the all time classics because don't worry, the pieces that you know and love have not necessarily been removed. There's just been lots of new ones added. And I have accompaniment for this one. I am using one of the brilliant backing tracks from Cat in the Keys Music. These come in a range of tempo, um, tuning systems on authentic instruments. And I do believe they have all of the Baroque sonatas from the ABRSM syllabus.
For grade eight, I challenged myself with a new piece. <laughs> yes, I had to practice this. I've chosen the solo piece Cory Mako by Gillian Whitehead. And although there's no time signature, that doesn't mean that there's no rhythm. Playing grades one to eight in a day. Oh, <laughs> always fun, always fun. So looking at the syllabus as a whole, you can download it, by the way, I'll put the link below. I really like how there's this mixture of the Baroque and Renaissance classics that our recorder repertoire is built on, lots of new pieces, but I'm also seeing a lot of folk music, jazz, classical, romantic music, things that we wouldn't necessarily expect on a recorder list, and that's brilliant. I'm also delighted, delighted to see that there are many more female composers and composers of colour on the syllabus. I've been talking a lot with ABRSM about this and they say that that's something really important to them too. And also though it's still not as many as we would like, it's something that they're committed to improving every time. If the topic of diversity in classical music is something you're interested to learn more about, I can recommend the brilliant books by Nate Holder. These are aimed at school children and the brilliant podcast Triloquy headed by Garrett McQueen. So I hope you enjoyed joining me through the new updated ABRSM syllabus grades one to eight. Which was your favourite of these new pieces? I'd love to hear, leave it in the comments below. And there are many, many more. So if you're interested in challenging yourself with a grade exam, or just following the syllabus to give you some handholds as you work your way through different music. Check it out below. Let's wrap it up. As always, you can subscribe to my channel by clicking on my face down here. Over here's the Team Recorder Patreon where you can choose to support the channel and hear some more videos. Thanks for watching and have a great day. Bye.